All right, so the other day I was scrolling to YouTube as usual, and I found one of this guy's videos on my recommended. There's a guy with over 1,000 subs that literally has my name. And as you can see, my name is very, very original, so that was definitely very surprising to me. All right, so he has over a thousand subs, right? Whatever. But the last time I checked on him, he had only like a few hundred subs. Then I went on his about page, when he's actually tracking the progress of the subs that he has. Look at this, he started his channel last month, he had 10 subs, and just a month later, a thousand subs. He is growing really, really, really fast. And at this rate, I might just become the second most subscribed queue master. This is not good. And also I want to look at the social blade a little bit. So here's mine. So C plus, you know, that's not bad. Then we got the cubicle here. What's up the cubicle? Nice ad. Then we got subs every day, 10 to 20. Uh, that's not too bad. The views aren't too bad either. Okay, cool. But now let's look at his. Not only is he getting 10 to 20 every day, there are days when he gets 100 in one day. 100 in one day. Look at that. Absolutely insane growth right there. 40 today and it's still going. So again, I'm not accusing anyone of anything, but this guy is growing super fast. So I think the days of me being the most subscribed key master is going to be over pretty soon at this rate. So let's look at these stats first. He made this account, I guess, a long time ago, but he started posting recently. He has nine uploads, over a thousand subs, and 15,000 views, which is a quite a weird ratio right here. All right, now here's my channel made four years ago, and with those four years came 230 uploads, 400,000 views, and just around 3k subs. So yeah, look at those stats. Again, I'm not accusing him of anything, but I don't know, they just look a bit different. That is strange. So let's look at his content here. He has some solve videos with some nice thumbnails. He has some pattern videos, which is super cool, and that's also what he says he does. And he does uh, tutorials, I guess. Cool. And wait, check this out. He has two videos that have the same exact thumbnail, same exact title. And this one's one second shorter. Interesting. You know, this guy is overtaking me in subs very soon. This guy's growing insanely fast. So I think I shouldn't be mad, but I should be learning from his content. So let's just watch some videos here, I guess. All right, now let's see him do the Rubik's Cube in 10 seconds. So 12,000 views, that's a ton of views. And 10 seconds is what I average. So let's see what makes this video special. First off, some white bars, that's pretty cool. All right, let's go. He's going to inspect the cube, put it down. Cool, okay, nice Petrus block right there. Nice, another block, cool. Ooh, he had a double X cross, wow, I didn't even notice that. And PLO skip, wow. So yeah, that was pretty fast. Seems like a really legit solve, I think. Just got really lucky. All right, now let's look at the comments a little bit. Interesting method. For sure it was. He was getting a free double X cross and doing like Petrus. That was cool. Interesting smart doing this cube solving. Very nice. Definitely. Keep on blogging. You have amazing skill within se 17 seconds. I see a lot of non-cubers in the comments. I never cringed so hard before. This guy's just a hater. Also something interesting I'm noticing is that a lot of these guys are vloggers in his comments. And actually I get this a lot too with people like having vlog channels commenting on my channel saying stuff like this. I don't know how that happens. Maybe it's the YouTube algorithm or is there like some comment bots stuff going on? I have no clue, but I always get some vlog comments on my channel saying the exact same things. So interesting. All right, let's watch another video. Maybe this pattern video. Cool. Wow, I guess he got his own intro. That's cool. All right, so let's just watch this intro. Wow, maybe that's why he's going so fast. He has this insane intro. Maybe I should start doing this kind of stuff. What do you guys think? All right, let's look at the comments. Wait, first off, 200 views, right? Not bad. 105 likes. Half of his viewers are liking this video. Wow, that's actually a super good ratio. Cool. Wait, and 171 comments? So more than two thirds of his viewers actually comment on the video? That's interesting. And he claimed that he got 50 plus views in one minute. That's absolutely insane. I never even got that myself, I don't think. Wow. And of course, we got a lot of vlogging comments. Interesting, of course. Again, I am not accusing him of anything. Please don't send hate to his channel, but just an interesting channel, I guess. All right, so that's it for this video, I guess. I'm not sure what the point of it was, but please don't send hate to this guy's channel. I don't think he really means any harm. He's just doing some 
kidney videos. And I guess if this is all correct, we might be overtaken soon as a number two Q master. So yeah, you know, there's T-Series versus PewDiePie and like Coco Melon versus PewDiePie. Screw all that. Q master versus Q master. So yeah, if you guys want to help me out, maybe sub or something. This guy's going super fast and I don't want to be the number two subscribed Q master. However, if this guy does take over me in terms of subs, I might just have to change my name. I just can't deal with being the number two Q master. Like if you're the master, you're the number one and I can't be the number two number one if you know what I mean. So yeah, that's it for this video. If you do want to check out his channel, the link will be in the description maybe. And yeah, there you go. Thanks for watching guys.